Well, apparently I'm supposed to talk to this Marty guy. Yeah, well, we're, we're going to we're gonna unmute Marty now so uh, he can raise whatever contentions he has. Can a mod put out an announcement that Marty's debating him? Oh, you're, there we you're, go. You're uh, unleashed, Marty. Uh, do I have to? Uh, can, I, oh, can I just say, um, uh, can I just say, uh, Gurach, I don't know if I'm just going to destroy your name, but I would appreciate the fact that she asked me nice questions. She was very uh, calm, collected, and then... Um, I appreciate that kind of discussion instead of like some someone trying to be a dick womble. So hopefully, Marty, you can follow uh, this girl's intelligence. Hopefully. Uh, well, how about this? I'm opening my beer right now. I'm going to have a beer while I'm doing this. Let's get a smile. But okay. <laughs> I'll need it to calm my nerves. <laughs> All right, so uh, just to begin with the, uh, the very beginning, uh, you talked about evolutionary theory and uh, how it sort of helps for survival. And I'm guessing also you're going to say that it helps for, uh, you know, reproduction, creating offsprings. I'm not really sure how that isn't sort of appealing to nature. So can you tell me how that doesn't commit to the fallacy of appealing to nature? That is to say that just because things happen in nature, that that's how we ought to perform as ethical agents. Okay, we're gonna have a philosophical argument here. Oh, wow. Now, if you wanna be like Guru, you can ask me an actual question, or you can be a simpleton and try and give me some philosophical question. That's a philosophical question. And then there's no answer to it then. There's, there should be an answer to it, right? Do you know what a naturalistic fallacy is? Doesn't matter. There's no answer to it. What's that? I just told you the answer to your question, pal. If, 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 listen, hold on, hold on a minute. If, if you're going to come in here, like, I'm, I'm going to be as honest and polite as humanly possible. Philosophy doesn't so, answer. <laughs> is your way of saying you're going to be polite as possible by calling your interlocutor a simple? No, you didn't let me finish. But if you would, it'd be nice. I said okay, if you was if you was gonna come in here and ask me a philosophical question, that is not the same as what Guac just did. There is no answer to philosophical questions. That's why it's called philosophy. Wait, how do you how do you get from that to there are no answers to philosophical questions? Because philosophy is questioning reality. That's literally Latin. That's what it actually means. Philosophy is to question. What's your fucking point? Where is that stipulated in philosophy? Is it etymological? Is it historical in any sort of sense? And how is understanding reality uh, just a I matter just of... I just literally the told you. That's actually the fucking name. Philo philosophy it's well, like, the, etymolo well, the like, etymology of philosophy is the love of wisdom, right? Are you trying to be too smarter than you actually are? No, that's not an argument. That's just an insult. Well, considering I just had a great conversation with somebody and you're already fucking it up, I should it just... It seems like an emotive claim. claim. I just want to know what your arguments are. An emotive claim. Jesus Christ. What, what, what question do you want to ask me, dude? Well, how does your appeal to evolutionary explanations for the survival of our species have anything to do with ethical judgments whatsoever, right? So, again, it does how is that not just appealing to Nate? How is that not? It does not have any, because you just made that shit up. But I didn't solid. make up the naturalistic fallacy. You, you, just, you just made it up. It's solid. Continue. It That's seems like an empirical inaccuracy to say that I made up the naturalistic fallacy. I can give you some papers on it to suggest Sorry, why that would be. Just confuse mathematics with philosophy. Okay. <laughs> How did I confuse mathematics with philosophy? Because one provides questions and answers, the other one doesn't. Science. What? Sci Sci Let me give you a historical lesson. Because clearly you're not that smart. Even though you, apparently you have a PhD, did you say, or something? Someone said he's got a PhD. Let me tell the difference between science and philosophy. Science is fucking answerable with these weird things called numbers. Philosophy is, isn't. There you go. 
that's the answer to your fucking question. Now, if you want to ask me stupid philo philosophical questions, I don't see how that's relevant. It is relevant because you're supposed to be asking me about. You're supposed to be asking me a philosophical question about models, correct? Not mathematics. Now make up your mind which one it is before I. I didn't. I never mentioned anything about mathematics. You couldn't be. You couldn't ask me anything because you're not that smart at this point. Well, actually, no. I just did. So I asked you how you does didn't your ask early. Me anything. I just said you how did your anything. early explanation not commit a naturalistic fallacy, right? So just you because keep evolution naturalistic fallacy like the what? survival <laughs> of our species, I don't see how you oh. laughing is going to. It's any I'm, bit easier for you. It's not going to make it any easier for you. If you want to calm down by laughing, that's fine. It's not going to make it any easier. I'm asking you, how did the survival of our species through evolution, right? Um, how does that aid in any sort of way about how we ought to act as human agents, right? And ought. Oh, wow, that's awesome. Do you believe in God? I don't see what that has to do with anything. Do you believe in God? I don't see what that has to do with our conversation. Because you're thick. Answer my question. Do you believe in God? How does being thick have anything to do with God? And how does that have anything to do with the original question? Clearly, you're not up to scratch. Do you believe in God? I'm not going to answer that question. It's irrelevant. You're not as smart as you think you are, pal. I'm glad that you think so i don't i mean i don't really care what you have to say i think everybody just listens to this conversation is no issue not you know you're not smart enough to deal with me put it that way <laughs> okay so he doesn't actually have anything to say i don't i mean his responses are both laconic and vapid all right there's some big words for you meaning they're short they actually have nothing in content in them. You haven't actually said anything in terms of a form of an argument. Certainly, I could either accept an allegory or a narrative or some sort of, I don't know, anything. I mean, it doesn't even have to be a syllogistic argument, but you're not even providing an argument in defense of what you believe, right? Because you're just letting emotions... Not, not, none, of them would be none of them would be applicable. <laughs> oh, by the way, did I mention I'm actually English? I'm not American. I'm English. Okay, you well, speak. Cool. I'm not actually. I'm not I just. Actually, I, I just want to point out one fact. I'm not. I'm not that American either. No, like, so. Well, whatever the fuck you are, I don't care. You speak my language. So. By the way, I wanted to point out that you made an empirical ac inaccuracy by saying that veganism right. is predominantly a Western characteristic. Did you know that it's? You know, there's a lot of vegetarians also within the Eastern world. Uh, that's not empirical, dude. Fact. So if I point to you to some sort of journals that suggest that that's the case, are you gonna admit your? Point to, you can point to whatever the fuck you want. It still would be wrong. So even if I provide you empirical data to suggest that you're wrong, empirical you're data wrong. what from the West? Since but well, no, not the West, the East as well, right? right the East, which would be yeah, what India, a thousand, a thousand, two thousand years. Even even though a cow is the sacred. Buddha of India, okay, talking shit, I'm fine. You wouldn't eat a cow if it was sacred, right? What well, are you talking because about? Of, because of religion, clearly. What does that matter? You'd still have an empirical claim that's inaccurate. I just told you I wouldn't eat a cow because of God. Doesn't mean I couldn't eat a cow. Though, does yeah, it? I'm not making any claims on modalism. What, what, what question are you going to ask me, dude? I that already asked be, you a question. Without, you, without you, without you trying to be philosophical and talking shit at the same time. I didn't You're talk shit. I'm just asking okay. questions. I'm, I'm just, I'm just going to point one thing out. Do me one favor. Just open Google right now and type in um, Stanford University philosophy edu. Well, education, I suppose it would be, which is my bible. So please entertain me. I mean shit. I've crushed people about the cosmological arguments, and you think you're going to kill me over, what, being a vegan? Please, do better. I'm fucking bored already. At least your good friend here, with a, a very nice voice, was entertaining and polite. You're fucking stupid at this point. Please. Are you asking 
me to provide you an SCP or not the naturalistic? I'm, I'm, not, I'm asking you to just stop using big words to think that you're smart because you're not smart. Using big words doesn't make you smart. It, it just makes okay, you look like a cunt when I, I destroy him. Which big word did I use so I can... Uh... You're, not, you're not doing anything that makes me fucking interested in having a conversation with you. You're fucking boring. Like, literally boring. <laughs> okay. Yeah. All right, buddy. Yeah, you are. Are you gonna, but you're going to prove I'm morally wrong about veganism. I mean, it's not the point of the conversation. Or ethically wrong about being a fucking. Well, I don't have to, right? I can, I can make it. I can make it even easier, yeah, right? I'm, I can, I'm, I'm still waiting. I can show that I'm you're inconsistent about your beliefs, about your own internal moral beliefs, oh, which I tried to. Believe. Okay, it's a belief of fact. Well, there are going to be facts about it's one's a belief own. of fact. It's a belief of fact. Well, I think justified true it's beliefs a, are fact. It's right? a, a justified true belief is not a fact. Shut up. The say it's just the same. No, it's thing. not. No, it's no, it's not the same. Knowledge thing. is going to respond. No, it's not. Sort of oh, I, oh, I, no, it's not. Shut up. Uh, okay. you relig- uh, so uh, all of a sudden you're religious. Huh? Shut up. Uh, what does that have to do with religion, buddy? Well, the fact that you're trying to use religious arguments to prove that you're a vegan and therefore you're morally superior than everybody else. Keep going, I bitch. See. I will well, piss I on you. I will piss problem. on you. I will piss on like, you. I'm still waiting. No, to no, no. You can piss all over you, whoever, right? It doesn't really well, matter. Because the problem is, is that you don't understand arguments. I do. Right? I'm, I'm lit- I mean, I have undergraduates I am, taking my Phil 101 lit- class that lit- form better I'm arguments waiting for you. after taking two I'm days of my philosophy course. I'm you have waiting. probably reading all this. I, I am literally still waiting. Right? Right? I mean, I'm still waiting. Give me any evidence that being a vegan is objectively true. You don't Go have on. to offer uh, a claim of objectivity with respect to veganism being yes, objectively yes. true. Yes, you do. Okay, so show me why I need an objective principle, ethical principle, to prove why you're inconsistent. You just use the word ethical. Ethical is minus. The, why do you right. use so the do word you ethical? Think that ethics can be related towards the subject? Ethic, ethical is subjective in this nature. You just yeah, okay, so you, you saying, so, right? so what ethical you're saying is, is in your arguments, I'm going to use an objective statement is, and use ethics ethical. is subjective when it's a subjective. If ethics is subjective, is. right? Yes, it is. And then you have yes, your own is. internal form of ethics. which is subjective. Yes, keep going. Then you can have a, still an inconsistency among your own ethical system, and I'm saying you have you're internally inconsistent. Among yeah, but, your own ethical norms, right? Oh, wow. That's like me calling you a fucking cracker. No, it's not. Nice. It actually has nothing yeah, to do with that whatsoever. I know you use, I know you use long sense, words, right? but that's called that's called an opinion. You see, you you try and use long words. Actually, it's not really... It has nothing to yeah, do it with it. It's an opinion. And that's because you it's don't know opinion. what... It's an opinion. No, you don't know what the fuck... Fact. You don't even know what the fuck you're saying because you don't even know what the fuck to ask me because that's how stupid you fucking No, are. I did are you actually gonna, ask you, you a question ask, earlier. Are you gonna ask me anything? But you didn't actually reply to it. Because the question I'm itself was retarded. It. I told you that no already. Ask me a question instead of trying to propose something which is philosophical, which makes you sound smart, and you ain't smart. So ask me a better question, please. Be my guest. I mean, your friend... Clearly, is a lot better than you, and she didn't need to use philosophical bullshit to ask me the basics, did she? No. So get on with it already before I fucking leave this shit. By by all means, man, I'd prefer if you leave. You're, oh, you're crap, you and you don't like me that. stepping on your face with my boot. No, it's just because I don't like your voice. I think you have a very punchable voice. Oh my god! Now I'm gonna tell you that's a. What, what, what's that called again? What's that called when you use somebody else's position instead of their argument? What's that called? What's that called? I don't Come know. On. I mean, you, oh, you don't, you don't know what it's called. Like you don't know what stuff. it is when you insult somebody and actually ignore their question. Like, you don't know what that is. Look, Even though you I just said your red philosophy. Is. I know what a straw man is. <laughs> no one said straw man, dude. That guy said it. It's called an ad hominem. Now get on with your fucking point. I, I said that the very first time. Get on thing with your point on board. Are, are you literally the only fucking retard in here who's willing to ask me All right, questions? anyways, I'm not going to continue anymore. So this Good, not fuck off. Fine. No, you're boring. You're fucking boring. Someone else asked me. 
You're shit, dude. At this point, I would just... <laughs> dude, I read Stanford University's Bible every day. Shut your mouth. Crush niggas like you. I don't like you. one single fucking argument. I, I, don't, I don't need to argue with a fucking dunce. Go away. You're not that smart. I argue with theologians. I don't argue with fucking morons. If anybody want to fucking conduct a conversation with me, other than this dumb shit, I'll be more than happy. Otherwise, shut the fuck up. Marty, would you like to get a last word in? I can mute him if you want to get a last word in. Uh, sure, if you want me to. Okay, yeah, you go ahead and give your last word, and then Stizer, if you want to talk to others, you're welcome to. Go ahead, Marty. Uh, just simply the fact that he uh, seems to get empirical evidence incorrectly. He doesn't respond to empirical evidence. He doesn't actually give an argument against this sort of uh, and sort of the questions that I asked. Doesn't I mean this guy is to use his own words beyond the pale, uh, and he seems to just be insulting people instead of actually addressing anyone's questions. So if you if he wants to insult people, like. It's cool. He could do that all day and night, and I'm sure it's going to really bring in people because people enjoy seeing, you know, his little hissy fit. But I don't, I don't, I don't think you're going to convince him after this. So, anyways, I'm okay. done. All right, and Stizer, if you want to have a last word, to, oh, sorry, Marty was saying one last thing. What's that, Marty? Change my name back, man. Oh, <laughs> okay, I'll do that in a sec. All right, Stizer, I'll uh, unmute you. You want a last word about Marty? No, because he's not relative. If anybody does want to actually continue with the conversation, you're more than welcome. I'll be more than welcome to engage with anybody who wants to have an actual conversation instead of this guy trying to be smarter than he actually is.